So I'm just about to cook uh, my dinner using my brand new pan. It's called the uh, multi pan, but it's also called the uh, master pan. Uh, five in one. Uh, bought this off uh, eBay. Got two of them for 38 quid, and I give one to my mother. So this is it. Quite light, I suppose. Obviously, problem is is the size of it. But then, what do you expect? You knew the size of it before you before you voice, but uh, I've seen videos on YouTube, so I'm not going to go into too much. Got all my ingredients ready, so here we go. Right, so let's get things cooking. Gas on. Uh, let's put some olive oil in. There we go. And uh, start with the uh, black pudding and the uh, hash browns. Who knows, I might not even have room for everything. <laughs> and uh, put the sausages in as they take longer to cook. Believe it or not, I thought I would have more room. But uh, let's put uh, some olive oil in. I'd wait for that to heat up actually. Let's uh, put the beans in. Oh, let's get a spoon for that. So I'm just going to move this a bit. I think this middle bit could have been bigger. I just want to put the uh, tomatoes in. And I've still got to fit the uh, bacon in yet. I'll turn these around. Put olive oil in on these bits and crack the eggs because I don't know how long this side bit takes. But we'll uh, try and get a bit more centre. The uh, mushrooms in. So I'll just put the eggs in. Like I say I've still got to do the bacon, but I've run out of space at the moment. I'm just packing other things away that I don't need and now I can get the plates out. Well I've managed to uh, fit one piece of bacon in. I think these are... Uh, yep, nice and done. Obviously the problem with this pan is getting everything ready at the same time. So it's non-stick, you don't really have to use that much olive oil. There's nothing uh, is sticking. Oh, it's getting there, nice. So a bit of parsley and the eggs. And on the uh, tomatoes and mushrooms. Time to check these uh, sausages. Yep. Colour. I think this black pudding is done. Yep. Half brewing's almost done. The eggs are definitely done, so I'm going to take them out. Like I say, the problem with this is getting everything done at the same time, or that's ready at the same time. So just put another piece of bacon in. But I suppose the good thing about this pan is uh, if I was to do this, I would be uh, using what, three, four pans. But just doing this with this pan, I've only got the one. 
Let's just hope it fits in my dishwasher. It does have this handle on the top as well. Ah, that is hot. So obviously I can touch that, not a problem, but try and touch that and it is hot. So I'll maybe use some uh, oven gloves if you're gonna lift it. Definitely put the beans in too early. That's it. There. <laughs> yep, some nice colour on there. See the hottest bit of the pan is this bit here in the middle, like. I'm hoping these sausages are done. A nice plate full of food. So next time I do this, I think I'll get the sausages in first with the hasbrunes, and then probably the bacon as well, because do the do the beans and the eggs at last. It's all about timing basically with this pan. These sausages are done. Mm. Ah, hot. I have got a pair of metal tongs I should be using. Come on, there you go. And the bacon's done as well. So there you go. A full English. I don't think I've left anything apart from uh, maybe some fried bread. All done in one pan. And I can't put it in the dishwasher yet. One, it's too bloody hot, and uh, the dishwasher's already on. <laughs> yep, so not bad. Black pudding, beans, tomatoes, mushrooms, hash browns. Sausages, bacon, two eggs. And obviously, I did the toast and the toast that 